Rebecca. Now, Valerie has been with Toastmaster only two and a half years, yet she recently chartered the NJIOT Toastmaster Club. So let's give her a big round of applause for that. That's, you know, I've been here 10 years. I haven't done anything close to that. She is also the charter president and club sponsor. She is VP of this club, which is Mary Brown's Treasury Toastmaster Club. So like I said, without further ado, and oh, I have to introduce her speech as well. And she is gonna be our speaker of the day uh, from advanced communicator series, communication speaking to inform resources for informing. Let's give a big round of applause for my esteemed colleague, Ms. Valerie Mecca. have made a face like this, whether internally or externally, when you were asked to give a presentation or run a meeting? Well, you're not alone. I've made this face when I was asked to give a presentation in 2012 by my manager. And although I knew in my heart that I really wanted to give the presentation, my mind was screaming, no, no. As I stepped out for the greater good, it all worked out and I was able to get out of the box. Good afternoon, Mr. President, fellow Toastmasters and welcome guests. My name is Valerie Mecca and my speech is on getting out of the box and what Toastmasters did for me. It helped me to not be a person who's intimidated by upper management. Instead, I'm the intimidator. As I gave that presentation back in 2012, I saw that it really was false evidence appearing real, that if you put your mind to something and said it, you'll be able to achieve it. What happened was after that presentation, people came up to me and thanked me for giving that presentation and that they learned a lot by it. And that was a morale booster. A year later, I found out about the, the Toastmasters Club in the Treasury Building and decided to attend as a guest. The people there were wonderful, the speeches were great, and as the people were being evaluated, it was positive uh, structure that they were being told to make minor changes. But all in all, it was definitely edification, it was great job, your speech was amazing, and through the process, you would see people changing and growing. When, when I joined the club, several months later, I, was, I had gotten my booklet about two weeks after, and there's a communication and a leadership track. As I used both of these books and moved along the track simultaneously, I completed the both of the books within 14 months. 